Hey, what's up, guys? My name is Smeldron, and welcome back to another episode of Seven Days to Die, my friends. Thank you guys for tuning into this episode, and I hope that you guys enjoy. We are going to be starting off very fast. We need to get this quest done, okay? We're getting really, really close to day 21, um, and day 21 is going to be a really, really scary day. I have plans for day 21. I want day 20 and day 19 to just be farming days, um, or at least the end of day 19 to be a farming day. Um, and we still got a lot to level up on our characters so we can, uh, you know, craft some better level action rifles because I want to use rifles. I want to use penetrating shops. I want to use AP rounds and I want to use rifles during day 21. And for us to make that happen, we have to level up a lot. And that is the reason, my friend, that we are going to go do this quest so we can get the experience so we can level and potentially even get ourselves like a higher level rifle or whatnot. You know what I mean? So everything's at play here. Uh, ooh. Ooh. It's like a mansion, isn't it? I'm, uh, hmm. It's crazy because this house is actually not in a town. If I'm not mistaken. Uh, oh, no, no, we, we are. We're in a town. Okay, never mind, never mind. I take that back. Interestingly enough, though, this house is actually pretty freaking big. Hello. Surprise, he tanked that first. That was you. Excuse me, sir. All right, this, this, uh, this, this gun here. I love it. Okay, I just want to let that, you know, be known that I love this gun. I think it's amazing. Let's go ahead and raid this place. Um, I've never actually raided a place like this before. And if I'm being completely honest with you guys, I've never... I'm just, you know... Okay. Whoa. So we start off at the top here, obviously. I don't know how you hit me. Not bad so far, though. A little interesting, a little rope down. I'm pretty sure I can't go back up there, though. Okay, this will be interesting. So you start off at the top, big old house. Pretty much kill everything in here fairly quickly. Anything back here? No. Hello. Oh, what? I don't know how I missed you. But I mean, so far, you know, it's not that difficult for me to kill things down here. Obviously, we're not at the deep, deep part. We're still on the ceiling, aren't we? Still at the roof portion. Looking for more zombies. Gotta fall down in there for sure. Anything up here that I should know of? Doesn't look like it. Hello. I think that was a feral. His eyes were red, at least. That's actually kind of a nutty find. Some, uh, some blueberry. Blueberry uh, schematic there. Not too bad. I don't think I'm going to have the resources to make blueberries, but we still got it, though. You know what I mean? That's all that matters. Definitely a zombie in there. It's always zombies in there. Okay, yeah, let's go. Let's go. Oh, medical supplies. Even better. Definitely going to be taking you. And we go outside here to the right. Bird. Oh. And perfect jump. Eh. I think this house is gonna have some amazing loot though that's a second feral she was definitely a feral if i'm not mistaken second feral we've run into so far but i do got my shotgun i do got my magnum so i'm not too frightened at all to be honest i know i shot him in the head he's mad at me there we go I'm just gonna take him out. I don't want him to. I don't want him to do the things he wants to do. You know what I mean? Hello. Barrel number three. Definitely feral number three right there. Don't mind if I do take that. Definitely gonna have to go downstairs. A lot of these doors are locked. It makes me want to try to open them. I'm not even gonna lie to you guys. I think I am, actually. I mean, why not? I got this pickaxe here. Oh, man. Like, opening these doors? Easy work, brother. Easy work. Nothing in here, though. Some walking outside. Bro, with my old tools, it would have taken forever to bust inside of one of these. Okay, so it's really pointless to, to unlock these, pretty much. For the most part. That's that's what I'm getting at here. It's just pointless. Yeah, because that just unlocks over there. So, yeah, it's, it's, it's just no point. Big guy probably outside. It's fine. You just keep him outside. 
Hello. Downstairs portion down there. I don't know where that door goes. You know, I'm gonna kill this dude. I don't have time for him. Easy kill. Easy kill. Um, I'm gonna hit this because I don't know where this one goes. Might be useful. Oh. Oh, this goes behind that. Oh. And that goes down there. Okay. The rest of this is just a dead end. It's the only thing that's important this way is this. It's down here. I'm not sure. Hello. Chemistry stuff down that way. Nothing that way. And then in here. Okay, that just goes there. Okay. Okay. So the only interesting part is probably that like chemistry spot. Um, that's the only thing I'm noticing, at least. It's back here. A little hidden chemistry workstation. Some unlocked doors, some crates. I'm gonna come back for all this. Gonna unlock all the doors first. And you got that, you know? I I'm pretty sure all of this probably links back to... Like, the main spot we were supposed to go down the first time. I'm pretty sure it all links back to there. More than likely. Holy shit. Holy shit. All right. Get your fucking pistol out. Holy crap. All right, that happened. Fine though, we're fine though. That radiation zombie? No joke. No joke. And then my dude wouldn't get the uh the magnum out, bro. My dude wouldn't get the magnum out. He just kept the uh the shotgun out when I needed the reload. That was scary. Take all this stuff though. I need this. Especially that nitrate. I need to nitrate the uh some gun powdery stuff, I believe. But anyways, let's go ahead and get all this stuff. Nothing's in there. What's this? I'll take the glue. You know, I'll take the lead too. Why not? Why not take the lead? There's no point for me not to take the lead. I'm thirsty. All I got is coffee. Better than nothing, I guess. All right, what y'all hiding down here? No way you got that many zombies, but don't got any loot, bro. There's no, no way. There's gotta be some loot in here, right? Right, guys? All right, so there's definitely loot in here and a lot of it. All right, I like that. I like that a lot. Now, what's in here? Okay. And this just goes back that upstairs. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Yeah, that, that definitely just leaves outwards, right? Pretty sure. Right? Oh, well, pretty sure after I like, yeah, okay, so that leaves outwards. Okay, so this is pretty much just the end part of it, right? Which makes sense. Let's go ahead and get all this loot. Hopefully some good stuff. And it's 2,000 right now, so I'm pretty sure the next time we come down here, um, all the zombies will be running. So that's going to be a little bit scary. But it shouldn't be anything we can't handle, right? Shouldn't be anything we can't handle. We'll be fine. Let's go ahead and unlock this pick. But yeah, definitely not going to be anything we can't handle. I'm wondering, so you guys remember the first time we went inside this base? I'm wondering if we would have kept going the way that we we're supposed to be going, would we have ended up down here? I'm like 80% sure. But it also makes me want to like go back and just make sure. What do we get here? Urban combat. We're going to learn that. Take all of that. Go nuggets is good. That's good. I'll take the beaker. Honestly, I'll probably just take all this. I don't have any steroids on me though. Disease resistance, I'll eat that. Kind of hungry, so I'll do that. I don't need snow. 
gonna need that. Um, radiator, not gonna need that, right? Most of the stuff I'm just not gonna need, for real. Okay, we should be fine with just this. Oops. Get this ammo pile. Lots of ammunition. Love to see it. Love to see it. Tough guy, fortitude. Take all of that. Don't need that though. Okay. Is that everything? Pretty sure. Pretty positive. Pretty positive. Next time we come down here, I'm gonna go like the actual way that uh that they like. Sounds like something's walking. I'm gonna go the actual way they they intended for us to go. So like breaking in and then uh going down the steps, I'm gonna go down like the the other pathway, the big pathway. I think it might be a little bit better. Or I could just come right back down here and just like Go straight to the big boy base. I mean, nothing stopping me realistically. You know what I mean? I really could. I'm walking a little bit slow, and I don't like it. What's this do? Damage mitigation. I need that water though. A little bit better. All right, let's go ahead and do this. I'm gonna go the legit way. We're just gonna go the legit way. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna be. You know, we're gonna go the legit way. Follow the rules. Either way, we have to kill all the zombies, right? Because this is a clear quest. So we're just going to have to take out all the zombies anyways. If it was like a fetcher, fetching, you know, like just a fetch. It's a different story. Thought he was still alive. He's making noises and everything. I wish I had me an AK, though. Like, for real. That way I could just, like, pray and spray through all those zombies. It would be kind of nice, I'm not gonna lie. Should be signed though, still. Always got, ooh. Probably already have it, but uh, don't mind learning this stuff at all. Always looking bookshelves, okay? Always looking bookshelves. When you're learning those things, bro, they, they're extremely handy. So I recommend everyone to always just look inside of bookshelves. I got to remember that last time we came in here, there was like, uh, like three, three pharaohs. Still shouldn't be anything we can't deal with. Take me some of this. I think that'll help a little bit, right? With the, uh, the little... Infection, not infection, but the little bruise that I got at least. Oh, steroids. Thank you. That will help a lot. Love that. Thank you so much for that. I guess, sir, nothing in here. Yeah, we're just gonna leave. Yeah, we're just gonna leave. All right. Burn. Dead burn. Backpack. Horn. Useless. You're dead. Oh, yeah, there was nothing in here. And we go outside. And then we pretty much just go straight across and then go downstairs. But Feral. I'm so glad Feral dude missed me. All right, now it's 2200. Which means now we're probably about to pull out the shotgun and start shotgunning, folks. Because... I'm not dealing with that, bro. I'm not dealing with all the zombies running towards me, you feel me? So, yeah. Definitely about to shotgun it up in here. No choice. I'm not playing no games. I mean, that's just attracted someone. Like someone from outside. See, we didn't go in here the last time, though. Hello. Which means we missed this. Probably nothing crazy. Yeah, I mean, some gunpowder. Mind if I do, I suppose? This way. Over here. Yeah, we missed all of this last time. I don't remember this box either. 
Take that. I'm a little hungry. I'm a lot thirsty, though. It's because I took those steroids. More than likely. I have any... Does coffee give you water? It gives you 24 water. I'll drink the coffee. Just for a little bit of water. Doesn't hurt. And then we go down there. Alrighty, go down here, and then zombie come through there, more than likely, right? A lot of zombies outside. I doubt they'll be able to get to me in time. They have a lot of things to break down, right? Holy shit! Oh my god. Oh my god. That scared the crap out of me, bro. Holy crap. Woo! That scared the crap out of me. Alright, alright, alright. We're still in this, though. We're still in this. Definitely not gonna die. About to go in here with the shotgun. About to shotgun it up. We're about to pistol it up. And we're leaving. That is the plan. Hello, everyone. Oh, my God. What in the world was that, bro? I'm getting a little bit scared, a little bit paranoid. That's the way out. I'm getting a little bit paranoid from everything outside. Coming on the inside. Just a little bit. Just a little bit, because a lot of stuff is breaking, and I can't close these doors. These doors will give me a little bit more security of me not about to die. I, I, I'm still pretty confident I'm not about to die, but it would make me a little bit more confident if I could close that door in front of me right there. Maybe a lot more confident, actually. I don't know what we just got, but I like it. We'll look at everything once we get back home. For the most part, I got zombies around me that are trying to kill me. And I don't like the fact that they're trying to kill me. So we're just going to get everything that we can out of this. We're going to call it a day. That is our plan. That is definitely our plan right now. Uh, I even want this. I'll take it just to take it. Righty, let's get the shoddy out. Last box. And we're pretty much home free home, I think. going on all okay, right all right now we should be home free home hopefully come on please 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 oh my gosh got stamina hold up hold up All right, let's get the freakity frack out of here. Freakity frack on out of here. Where's home? Returning trader. Okay. Imagine it didn't say returning trader. Imagine it said kill five more zombies. You're not done yet. No, I'm done. I'm going home, man. Have me a jump scare? Uh-uh. I have. I've had enough. That's enough for today. That's enough experience for today. No more jump scares for me, please. I'm. I'm done. I'm satisfied. I. I just want to get back home. All right, we made it home. Home, sweet home. Home, home, home. I love me some home. Let's go ahead and put our resources up here. Everything away. A lot of stuff can't go places because they're mostly meds, apparently. Ah, that's never a bad thing, I guess. Got a lot of ammo that time, though. Look at it, bro. I got... 
I got so much ammo. It's kind of disgusting how much ammo that I have right now. Well, it tips. Put the parts where the parts go. Do I? I got this, which is actually kind of nice. Kind of. Ooh, I could replace that. I could replace that. And I could. Yeah, let's replace. Replace this one. I wish you could put like two on one. That'd be nice. I guess I could put the, that on there too. Why not? Right? Why not? Now inventory. Well, we got steroids on us, so we can't really like you know check what our inventory can hold. However, it can hold some stuff. A little bit more stuff than it could before. Never a bad thing. Brass goes into here. So I'm gonna put this magma. I'm gonna put the shotgun ammo up. I don't like having more than one stack of uh, ammunition on me. See, it's kind of like useless or whatever. I can go there, I guess. I need a lot of water. One thing we are. Oh, steel knuckles. Let's scrap that. I'm not going to use steel tools, realistically. Okay. And the only thing that we need now is. Oh! Yes, sir. The only thing we need now is water. Which we have none. Oh, I lied. I lied. Big time. We got a lot of water. Our drinking is now. And my food. I mean a little bit of both. That wasn't a bad run though. Um I didn't really get anything like crazy, I suppose, but like It was fun. I'll give you that. That was fun. That was not bad. Ooh, I am hurt like crazy. I got a broken arm and everything. A splint, so I need a splint. I'm infected. Do I have a splint? Yes, sir. That'll help a lot. Um, Not really much I can do against this 15% uh, infected, though. Don't have any antibiotics for that. Probably not going to get any anytime soon, either. Unless Mr. Trader Man wants to reset and give us some. That would kind of come in handy right now. I need to stop drinking water. I think I'm drunk enough. All right, what time is it? We're at one o'clock. It's foggy as all hell out here. That is nuts. Super foggy. What's our level up? We're a little bit before we level up again. So the plans for my levels, at least, I want to work on Deadeye and I also want to work on the Penetrator, right? And we need to make AP bullets. The AP uh, ammo. Or, okay. 762. It's like, oh, we can't even make these. Sniper volume six. Wow. Okay. That's bad. Um, hmm. Because the only way we could do armor penetration, if I'm not mistaken, from this uh, little thingy thing here, you see it says, um, where is it? Yeah, armor piercing rounds can penetrate an additional target or a block. Now, it just says armor piercing rounds, which AP stands for armor piercing. You know what I mean? But I mean, it just says you find weak spots in arm, uh, targets army. You can use AP rifle bullets to shoot through multiple organic objects, which means we need AP bullets. We can't make any AP bullets because we just don't have the. We don't know how to make it. We know how to make the high high power bullets, but not the AP ones. And I don't think a high power would even work because it specifically says AP. So we would probably just have to buy these from the trader more than likely, more than likely. That kind of sucks, though, because, I mean, we got money, but, like, I don't want to spend it, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? Yeah, we definitely need to make this, though. Crack four, uh, quality four good uh, rifles. We can make a quality three rifle at the moment because we're at that level. But, like, why do that when I quite literally have a level four hunting rifle? You know what I mean? So, I would, if, if I was at level five, I would do level five, right? It's either that or buy from the trader, but I, I'm not even sure the trader's going to even have something like that unfortunately so that sucks um but yeah i'm going to wait until the trader opens i need to upgrade a lot of things in this base not really upgrade but like repair i guess especially this catwalk here you see that little opening there yeah we don't like that we don't like that opening at all so and then that right there like that's getting no support at all like this thing is getting no support like that bottom row no support and we need to fix that right so uh, I'm going to work on a little bit of that, and I'll catch you guys back whenever the trader opens. All right, so Trader Joe's just now opened, so we're going to check this guy out. 
Um, I didn't really do much to the base. Uh, I did a little bit, but I upgraded all of these with the forged steel that I had. So now these blocks have 10... Ooh, that hurt. Now these blocks have 10,000 health, right? So this right here, 5K, it pretty much doubled it. So now it's 10K. So this is not breaking. I, I have full confidence that this does not... It just won't break, right? I, I don't think it'll break at all. And how do I upgrade this again? I don't even think it's possible. Yeah, I don't even think you can go can go beyond Fort Steel because it's not even like it doesn't tell me like uh, what I need to do it. So I don't think you can. So this is like the max right here. This thing is not breaking. I'm um, also upgraded this a little bit. 3K right there, which to upgrade this again, I think I need to get the hatch. I actually might upgrade this again, but I think I need the vault hatch for that. So we we have the resources to make this. so We might as well make it um, just for this one right here because this is like the main defense wall, I guess. So, yeah, we're gonna, probably going to upgrade that. Um, and I also put a attachment on our sludge is a weighted head mod which has the chance to stun which i think that might be actually really good uh to have on our sludge um so i did that i was thinking about our ammunition situation here because i was going to make our uh, i was going to go farming to craft a bunch of ammo right that was like the plan i guess you could say um and I'm, I'm, now i'm kind of against it because if you look at this we have a lot of 762 ammo this is this is enough 762 ammo to last me a whole horror night, which I'm very confident in. Same thing with the shotgun. Very confident. We have 309 millimeter ammo, which I can just easily put in here. It'll fill up all the slots. I'm very confident. Um, the only thing that I was thinking about even like making was this the high power nine millimeter ammo, which I could take. I could put this in the turret, and the turret could do more damage. That was like the quite literally the only thing I was even like considering. I guess um so i might actually do that maybe i mean if i were to spend ammo or if i were to spend like the gunpowder or any of these resources or on anything it would be that realistically other than that i i just wouldn't spend it on much um i'm just hoping that i'm i'm able to buy some high powered 762 rounds from the trader dude because that's what i'm gonna need to do the bullet penetration which is really important for my build because I do want to have like a sniper-ish build, right? So I'm hoping you have something for us. Steel gloves or level four robotic turret. Level four robotic turret, man. Uh, I actually don't know. Um, let's see here. Turrets. So I can I can craft the level four one, right? But like the steel gloves. Steel gloves. I can't even craft this, right? So we're gonna take the steel gloves, and the gloves that I have on right now is just some level four, level five leather gloves. So I think the steel gloves would be a little bit better for us, for sure. Um, let's get ourselves. It's in the morning, so I guess we could just take this clear zombies. Everything else seems like restore power is 1.1 kilometers away, which we're not taking that. So we're gonna take this clear zombies. Definitely gonna take this clear zombies. All right, let's uh, modify this. Take everything off of here. And we'll equip this and then just replace it like that. All right. So let me see what you have in your inventory. Actually, I'm trying. If you have any ammo, any, can we get lucky? Dart ammo. Okay. So we got some 762 AP. We got 25 though, which I mean, for a sniper, it might not be too bad. Cause I mean, it is a sniper. You know what I mean? It's just like, boom, reload sniper. Um, so we're going to buy all of this actually. We're going to buy all of that about all of that um compound bow schematic is kind of nice but mm, i don't really have a bow like that really to be honest machine gun parts i guess that's really the only thing that is in here that uh piques my interest to be fair like everything else is just not me it's just not me bro just not me tough guy glasses fortitude i think i have a pair of those already yeah everything else in here is boo boo all right um yeah Thanks for shopping here. Come no again. problem my good friend no problem we're gonna do this quest really quickly not really quick it's 800 meters away so it's not gonna be quick at all but we're gonna be doing this quest oh i think that was my machine gun shooting at someone it was either that or me going over that hump i'm not sure which one was which um but yeah let's put this armor up just in case we die we have some good armor to come back to which would be really good put this ammunition up as well because we're not going to be using it a little bit of that and all the money goes into there all 
All right, my friends, thank you guys for watching this episode of Seven Days to Die. I really do appreciate you guys watching. I will see you guys on the next one for Shizzle. And I hope to see you faces there. All right, peace.